has 2022 gotten you in a pickle? Find out how you can save money this Christmas and more. I don't want a lot for better filament and better pizza, Papa John's. We start 2023 with a big bang, not the actual big bang. This did not work for brownies, or at least my mix of brownies. Bang, not the actual bang. We have a nice uh, vase looking, small here, but still very nice. Again, it has four designs. This is one of them. We well, have something a little bit more simple here. We actually have it on a white color. It's just a Christmas tree ornament. Nice loop through this hole here and you're set. We have a cool little ice thing here and this will get you going very easily. It's just two pieces, print in place and put together. Just like the TIE Wing Fighter, whatever it's called. I'm not a big Get Star Wars it. fan. We had a cool missile toad here, which is literally a missile on a toad. Very nice, and it also has the hole to put the loop through and surprise. You can hang it anywhere in your house and surprise a loved one. Finally, we have a big Christmas tree topper here, which actually took 10 hours to print, but it did come out really nice and I'm happy with the results because I just turned it on when I was going to work and I'm back and surprise, here it is. No need to go to the store, no need to worry about picking and choosing because online there are so many designs and thanks to Genos for sending filament for this video, we got to print out pretty much whatever we want. Moving on from the Christmas tree ornaments, let's talk about Christmas trees itself. I have three models here, two of which I printed the same but bigger and Seeing this is about only a quarter of my build plate, you can actually print a Christmas tree on your 3D printer. Just grab your favorite filament color, some lights, and for a room this big, which is a perfect for a hobbyist, you can fit it on your generic Ender 3, which is 350 millimeters, about this big, this big, and this tall. So you will be perfectly set to go with just a 3D printer this year if that's what you choose to do. But continuing on, I found these really cool designs. This is the original size and this is bigger but on a different printer as well. So we got to take that into account. But still, both of them came out really nice with this one looking a little bit more realistic and it also has the hole here. So it is an ornament as well but if I did print it big like this, surprise, it's just a decoration now and I can put these anywhere in my house for when guests come over and surprise, it's just something really nice to have and look at. This one looks the most like a Christmas tree but I was so scared printing this because it was just like <laughs> the printer was just going all over the place ham and running it was just very difficult to print this one compared to these but still they all came out looking really really nice off to the final aspects or what I have printed final for this project is cookie cutters so I just chose this star shape to show that it's proven to be perfectly working and I'm not going to be making a lot of cookies this year but I made brownies in this shape and it's not for brownies but it still worked pretty good and it's proven to be good moving on to some of the last things that I thought that could be 3d printed that could save us money were cookie cutters presents for kids or just wall art or wall decor now, funny story, when this was printed, it actually had a lot of static on it. So I was able to just put it on my wall and it stuck there. It stuck there until I showered, came back, touched it again and surprised, I became electrified and this thing did not stick anymore. But it's really cool to think that I could just print this, even two times this size I could print and just on a basic Ender printer and surprise, you have something that you would probably pay $15 at the store, but it only took you five, ten hours to print and not even a tenth of your roll. So this one definitely came in clutch as an idea or as a design. Moving on, we have cookie cutters. There are an infinite amount of cookie cutter shapes, but I chose a star here, uh, just something really unique to stand out. I was making brownies, but this did not work for brownies, or at least my mix of brownies. But there is a lot of designs and you guys can definitely make whatever you want as a design for a cookie cutter. So moving on to presents. Now I only have two here and these are old prints, very old. But they're very special to me because it just proves that 
with the designs out there, you don't have to go out and spend a lot of money on presents for every kit. You could have little things here and there to also complement lower grade gifts this year because I know things are a little hard for some people. But why not have fun and make it educational for everybody and have use out of your second 3D printer? Aha, see what I did there? Anyway, we have here just a little Among Us man and a creeper. So these are just two small things that I'm just going to point out as presents, but there is a lot of other things that you could print for anybody really, whether their age is young or older, because they even have car parts. Maybe you have a loved one that wants an intake scoop for their car. Surprise! Here you go! And it'll take you about maybe two days to print it, but it's a surprise for everybody that you can make on one machine and just be done for everybody without even having to go out of your house. Printing is always a breeze using Genos 3D printer filament. Why is this attached to the printer still? Well, we're going to run out. And this was a very old roll of filament. We got this about a year ago and it was still working perfect to print out all these white parts. So if you guys want to roll just like this, look down below for Genos products. Since this video is not only about giving back but also being thankful, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for all my followers and subscribers. All you guys have to do is comment on this video or comment on the correlating Instagram post and it's one entry per person. As long as you're within the 48 continuous states, you will get it with no extra charge. Seeing all of these together and also me explaining it, what do you guys think I'm missing? Let me know down below or what do you guys think I should have done differently for this video? Definitely have a great day and I will see you guys next time. Next week that is because we are releasing one video a week for the rest of this year. We're going to try to catch up on all of our views and all our likes because we really like to see a big difference. So we start 2023 with a big bang, not the actual big bang, bang, bang.